All right, so quick breakdown on how to build one of these rag dolls. So we grab a bone, we add a child shape. We set the child shape up to parent up to an origin object for the, each bone. So when this origin rotates, it rotates the uh, child bone because it's parented to it. But beyond that, it's actually compound parented, and that makes it so that this can't collide with this. And then this rigid body joint is the next section of the chain. So this is rigid body jointed to this. This is parented to this. This is rigid body jointed to this. This is rigid body jointed to this. All the way down the chain till we end up at the pelvis. So there's the pelvis. So the armature is parented to the pelvis. And then each armature bone uses copy rotation constraints that target one of these shapes. Like the forearm bone targets the forearm shape. The uh, upper arm targets the upper arm shape. And that way the body of the actor mimics the uh, rotations of the physics shapes. It's a pretty convincing dead guy. And we can view the physics And say we want to get a better view of what's going on here. I'm going to add a static mesh. Ooh. There we go. And then I'm going to rigid body joint this. To this. So now he's hanging from his head. And you can make sure all of his joints are bending correctly and nothing's going outside of its limits or anything. You'll notice his feet look a little weird. What we need to do is add a weight on the end of his foot. There we go. Now his toe should point down. Or not. Oh. I did the wrong thing. There we go. Now his toe should point down when uh, I press P. There we go. That looks like a person being hung. So, this is working. There is a rigid body rag doll. And then I'm going to end this constraint real quick. And I have a uh, method to test how the ragdoll is going to behave right here. Whenever he collides with it, I push on all of the uh, parts. So he should bounce around like he's on a trampoline having a seizure. Yeah, it looks good. There's some areas that pinch a little unrealistically, but uh, I made this 
actor in like 20 minutes. It's only pretty much his hips that need work. <laughs> 